What's up YouTube? Really wanted to shoot a video before I go to work on my pickups I got because I know I'll keep putting it off and off and I'll never show you guys. It's just going to rush it a little bit because I got to get to work in like 30 minutes or so. So first, I went to Columbus Flea Market and well, most of the stuff's from there so. <laughs> oh my god, is it a pain to freaking drive there. Jesus Christ, oh my. <laughs> it's an hour 20 to drive there for me. But if you miss a turn or something, it turns into like, oh my god, like hour 30, hour 40, hour 50. It took me overall, I would say, about three and a half hours there and back. And I was just dying. It was like 18 miles of straightness, 18 miles of like crazy turning and people honking because I don't know where the hell I'm going. I've been there before, but I haven't driven there. And I didn't know my GPS was set to no tolls. So we went completely different from last time. So, oh my god. But you know, it was worth it because I found a lot of stuff. My friend found so much crap. We took my car and oh my, that, that trip just killed gas. I had to completely fill it just to get there and back. <laughs> it easily was 200 miles. It took a whole tank, so it cost about 40 bucks just to freaking drive there. Not even what you spend. But it was worth it just because I found stuff I can't even find anywhere else. Simpsons Monopoly. I can't find this thing freaking anywhere. Got it for 15 bucks. Everything's brand new. There's like a board game store there. And the guy's like really into it. Like he's he's such a nice guy. He checks everything because most of it's used and he's selling it for like 5 bucks. And then he writes 100% complete or if it's missing a piece he won't even sell it. It's just such a nice guy. I asked him a month ago if he would ever get these in stock. And he said I'm, I'm constantly buying everything so he'll have it. I go there, he had two copies. I'm like, you, you're the greatest. <laughs> Went down in the flea market rows, and I found this guy that was just selling DVDs for a dollar. So I'm like, mine as well. <laughs> I got freaking P2. I don't remember too much, but I remember being pretty good. I got Saw 3. Now I own every Saw. I, wanted to, I was looking for Saw 3 the whole entire day. Cat Williams. I only got that because it's like 20 at Best Buy, so... Freaking why not? $20 freaking show. He's funny, but I don't know. I like other communes better, but he's he's good though. 1408. Sorry I got my shadow in here. Horrible lighting. Another great movie. Dollar, why not? Hostel Part 2. Because 1 and 2 were amazing, and 3 just totally messed it up. But if you want to see a sick twisted movie that's legal, because I know sick twisted movies worse than this crap. I can, I can name a few, but <laughs> you guys don't even want to check it out. Like Cannibal Holocaust, like freaking, um, what is that? A Serbian movie or something like that? Sick, twisted freaking movies. But this is like a sick, like in blood and killing. Those are just sick, sick, like eating animals and like, oh, I don't even, I don't even want to mention it. And my friend found this for me in a giant pile of books. The Simpsons philosophy they explain every episode in detail it's like a huge freaking like 200 page book i thought that was awesome for four bucks where are you gonna find that and lastly i went to gamestop i really wanted to pick these two games up since football season's coming and i don't pay 60 bucks for a madden that is just a waste of money but i'll pay half of that i'll pay 30 bucks which i got 12 for and i got test drive unlimited too i've been looking everywhere for that game gamestop's near me been sold out of that game for like freaking at least a year I've been looking for it. I don't know why I never went on eBay, but I finally found it. Thank God for that. It's 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 really it's actually it looks like a good game. I never played it. But it seems to be like the Sims. Except you gotta like make your way to the top of the fame, drive the nicest cars, win races. So it's like the Sims racing pretty much. It actually looks really cool. You get to customize your crib. You have to like customize your cars in the garage. It's kind of like Need for Speed, but plus The Sims. I thought it was really cool. It looked cool, anyway. So, yeah, and the rest of the stuff I just got, because it's my sister's birthday today, so I got her, like, a hell load of SpongeBob stuff. There's this one store, like, it's a toy store or something, but it, it had such cheap crap. I got, like, a giant, and I'm talking giant puzzle, SpongeBob puzzle, for, like, four bucks. And I got, like, coloring books for, like, a dollar stickers dollar the store is really good so i got her all that spent like 10 bucks on like so much crap for her 
Got my stepdad for his birthday's coming in two days. Got him the Three Stooges that just came out because he is he's in love with the show and everything. He was commenting like it should have been black and white just to feel like you're watching the old stuff. But I think the color and the new actors, it was it was good. I mean, I saw the bootleg with him, and but it like cut halfway in because the guy like messed up the recording or something. So I had to get him that. It just came out. Twenty bucks really isn't that bad. And I got my mom a little thing. But besides that, that's all I got today for pickups. So yeah, thanks for watching. Comment and stay tuned.